This is the Pop Sugar Must Have Box for September 2015. I got this today. I opened it up and once I looked at the video that I made of the unboxing, it was all out of focus. So I'm redoing it for you. It's new to you, old to me, but I hope you enjoy nonetheless. So let's get started. First thing is the little description card. It has a cute little woman and a sweater. I wish it was sweater weather here in Texas, but it's not. We got a little taste of it this weekend for my birthday, so that was nice. But um, these cards just basically describe what is in there. They always have nice art. They're well designed. Um, Pop Sugar, I think, is probably one of the best subscription boxes as far as design and uh, packaging. So um, if you open it up, it has pictures of the stuff, which I'll cover up so you don't have any spoilers, and descriptions of it, as well as the suggested retail price. Um, the theme is, or the inspiration for this box is travel, refresh, fashion fix, beauty recovery, to-go snacks, and hugs and kisses, XOXO. So let's get started with the stuff that's inside. Well, first things first is they always include a snack. Um, like I said, I already opened it up and I am slightly obsessed with uh, trail mix type things. So it's all gone. There's one lonely little almond in there that I missed. But this is uh, almonds to cherries, nourish snacks. It was really good. Um, they didn't have a lot of cherries in there, which I guess is why the calories are so low. But Anyways, it was really tasty. I don't know that I'd get it again, um, but it was nice to try something new. I always like to do that. Um, our little card in here, it says that the suggested retail value of that, of the snack, is $2, and that it's packed with 6 grams of protein, 3 grams of fiber, perfectly portioned to keep you energized and satisfied throughout the day. So there is that. Um, the next thing, and again, everything is already open, so it doesn't look as nice as it did when I opened it up originally, but this is a Hudson and Bleecker travel set. Um, it came packaged like this, and inside um, you get the TSA clear travel makeup thing or whatever, and then these little canvas like drawstring bags. Um, one of them has a bra on it for lingerie I suppose and the other one has shoes which is really a good idea to do. Um, you don't obviously have to use it for that. I'll probably use it to keep you know dirty clothes or whatever. I have two kids so little bags like this are always useful whether it's traveling or just a daily thing. Um, the card inside says a Hudson and Bleecker Labyrinth Onyx Travel Trio. This printed travel trio will make the inside of your suitcase look just as put together as your packed outfits. This TSA friendly clear pouch perfectly holds your toiletries while the drawstring bag neatly keeps intimates and shoes separate from the rest of your clothes. Suggested retail $42. I don't know that I'd pay $42 for that ever. But um, it is really high quality. The stitching is nice. It's nice thick fabric for what it is. You know, um, this isn't like those cheap little um, bags you get, you know, from fairs or whatever. So it is nice. I like it. And the print is really, really cute. So um, there's that. Get the next item for you guys. I really liked this. Um, I'm just going to be upside down for a second so I can read it. It is the Brio Geo Rosarco Milk Reparative Leave-In Conditioner Conditioning Spray. I was redundant, but there you go, nonetheless. Um, it smells really good. It smells like a, a fancy salon. When you walk in, you just feel all fancy schmancy and 
all that, and you never smell like that after you leave, especially me, because I have kids. But it's really good. Uh, my daughter, I've been using my daughter's Paul Mitchell Kids leave-in conditioner, so this will be nice to try. I'll smell different than she does. So, yes, yeah, very nice. Um, the card says, um, if summer has left your hair dry and damaged, here, I'll put this there for y'all to look at while I'm reading, um, try this reparative leave-in conditioning spray that will make your hair softer and stronger. Um, the antioxidant rich milky blend and nutrient packed argan, rose hip, and coconut oils will also act as a barrier against heat for healthy and smooth locks. Suggested retail, $20. Which, that seems about like it would be. This doesn't seem like a crazy amount. Hair stuff costs a lot, and this, it smells really good, and it felt good on my, um, when I had it in my hand, you know, just feeling it. Uh, we'll have to see what it does for my hair. Our next item is this NCLA Los Angeles Treatment So Rich Vitamin E Infused Cuticle Oil. It's in a really cute little as tiny. I know you probably can't see it very well, but um, it's a little cuticle oil. It smells really, really good. Um, suggested retail of this is $18. Um, it's easy to postpone your next trip to the nail salon with this cuticle oil that both softens and conditions. Just a drop to the cuticle, like so. The strengthening oil will keep your nails moisturized and smelling divine. It really, really does smell really good. And I don't have any of this cuticle oil, so it's awesome. And I'm a dork, so I like the little dropper. It makes me feel like I'm a mad scientist or something like that. It smells really, really good. This box has been great so far. I don't have any of this stuff, so I've been excited. So the next thing is... These super cute XO earrings. Um, our car describes them as the Chris Nation's XO stud earrings. Fill the love wherever you go with this handmade California XO jewelry. Cut from recycled brass and plated with 14 karat gold, it will add an understated sophistication to any ensemble. Suggested retail $35. So these are really cute. I don't usually wear gold, but I will wear these because it's not super shiny gold like that. Um, I consider the packaging an item as well because I can totally use this for a DIY gift or something. It's super cute. It looks like a mana potion or something. I love corked bottles. I'm weird. But yes, and here are the earrings. Um, they're very dainty, very much my personality. I'm very happy with this item as well. This is my first jewelry item for Pop Sugar, so I think it's a win. I like it. And let's see. Not an item necessarily, but I did get these two cards um, to share. Uh, PM us on our Facebook page, and the first people that request these, I will send you the cards code. I'm not sure. I haven't wanted to take it off of this, so I don't know if it's a code or whatever, but I will give it to the first people who request it. These Pop Sugar boxes are generally um, $49.95, I believe. So $10 off, it'd be cool to just try it for. You get $10 off. And I think normally these boxes, the if you go by the suggested retail of uh, price of the items, it end up being about 120 bucks. So you get 10 bucks off of the $40. So that's an even further discount. So that's cool. So just PM us the first couple of people that do that. I'll send y'all that. And let's see. Um, we have a 20% off. I'm not going to show y'all the code, just in case I decide to. But the uh, save 20% off of the Chris Nation's jewelry. I'm totally going to check that out because I think those earrings are cute. And I also got a makeup item um, by Too Faced 
and they sent a code. I'm going to cover it because I might use it. 20% off of that. So that's cool. You get a lot of coupons in these boxes, which I always love. I don't think I've used one yet, but it's nice to have the option to do so. Um, so the last item, this is the most um, uh, anticipated item, I'm sure. Um, this is the Too Faced Brow Envy Kit. Um, I need this. Usually, I would give this to my sister. She loves makeup, but I need the stuff that's in this. So sorry, Tosh, but I'm gonna keep it. Um, <laughs> the suggested retail value of this is thirty-nine dollars. Um, that right there is the cost of the box. So just in this one item, you've revamped your cost. So that's great. Um, and the card says for for envy-inducing brows, use this foolproof kit filled with all the tools you'll need for defined arches and framed brows. It has customizable colors, so you'll get the perfect brows no matter your shape, no matter your face shape or hair color. So there we go. And it's in a tin. It's really cute. It came in a box. It's gone now because, like I said, I am redoing this video. Um, you open it up. You have a cute mirror here. And it comes with a guide. It shows you all the ways you can use the kit and little stencils to help and tweezers, uh, brushes. I'm a makeup noob. I don't know what the name of those brushes, brushes are, but there you go. And there's a highlighter, uh, setting wax, blonde, and a brunette color. So I'm sure this is a great kit. Like okay, I don't know what happened, but my camera crapped out on me. So I laid these out a little nicer for you good people. Um, I think what I was saying is that here's the palette different things. came with three stencils. I don't know how to use these. It'll be a learning experience. But um, setting wax, highlighter, blonde, and brunette. Um, I think I know this set is good. My sister loves Too Faced. I know a lot of people on YouTube have raved about Too Faced products. So I can't wait to try it out. I think it'll be cool. Um, that's the last item. I'm sorry that it wasn't a surprise and you couldn't hear my reactions to the stuff. The other video was cute, but it was all out of focus. I don't think it would have been very interesting for you guys. So um, if you like this video, um, like our Facebook page, follow us on Twitter, uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Um, we're new. These videos will get better and better. I'm slowly getting more equipment and stuff. So. Um, thank you very much for watching, and uh, yeah, subscribe, and uh, let us know what you think about this in the comments. Thank you very much.